Hello everybody, this is Command Block Kid here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create an item generator in Minecraft 1.14 Java Edition. So let's go ahead and get started. First things first, place down a block, like an emerald block for example, that will serve as a podium for where the items are going to spawn and land on. What you're going to do next is you're going to dig two blocks down into the ground, Two blocks underneath, like so, and place down a command block. It doesn't matter what direction it is facing in. Right click it, and then type in slash summon Minecraft item. Type in three tildes, like so, and with the third, with the second one, you're going to put a three right next to the tilde on the right hand side. This signals that it is going to be three blocks above the command block's location. Then, type in two curly brackets like so, closing and opening. Type in item, colon, another set of curly brackets, and then type in ID equals, and you want quotation marks, Minecraft, colon, iron ingot, like so. And then now outside the quotation marks, you're going to hit a comma, and you're going to type in count, 1B, just like that. You're going to hit done. You want to get yourself out of the pit first. Place down a lever by sneaking and clicking. And now, just to test to see if it works, flick it, and it works. So now what we need to do is we need to create a redstone track. So we're going to take a little circuit around the command block like so. What you're going to do is you're going to pick a direction that the circuit is going to flow in. It does not matter which one, but we're going to go ahead and go with the command block's flow. So we're going to have the, a repeater set to four ticks here. We're going to have another repeater set to four ticks here. Now this equals a total of f two seconds. So 0 0.4, 0 0.8, 0 0.12, 0 0.16, point zero. We're going to go ahead, we'll add on a little more like so, for like space. We're going to place down another repeater. We're going to place down another repeater. And now we have ourselves a little bit of a circuit here. We're going to extend this area out just a little more. And once we have that all set, we have one more task to perform. now. That all right, so now that you've got this part done, you need to make sure that you have a lever on hand. You're going to go down here, like so, place the lever, and do the quick flick, like so. Flick it, and then flick it again. And now if you did it correctly, you should see some iron beginning to spawn every few seconds, like fi more like five seconds. Now what you have to do is you need to cover up all this. Uh, circuitry with something like grass blocks and other stuff that will blend into the terrain. And there you have it. You have yourself an always active item generator. Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.